May's clothes. This is not a capsule. If you're looking for a capsule, you're not going to get it here. What I do is go through my clothes for the in my existing wardrobe and decide what I can pull out that I can concentrate on wearing for the month. Textures, colours, weights of items. <laughs> and in a way, it's, a, it's not a 15-piece capsule, it's not a 20-piece capsule, it is a NASA clothes that I can actually wear. And hopefully you've got similar in your wardrobe and I know many of you like to follow along. So, Going through the items one by one, I have got this, this bomber jacket that I bought last year. It's in navy, it's very lightweight, and that might be a useful item. A safari jacket I bought a few years ago from Jules. I've actually got two of these. I've got one in a khaki colour and one in this lovely coral. Coral, that's the colour, isn't it? Yeah, it's coral, which I think is absolutely perfect for those um, spring days. It's a spring colour. There's that as well. Ivory jacket, this is a little bit thicker this ivory jacket and has ruched sleeves. I will link similar down for you below. It has appeared in many of the previous month's capsules. Until we get the hotter weather, it's still a useful item and it's a neutral. Denim jackets come out. I bought this jacket last year from uh, Marks and Spencers. It's a, a light wash jacket and um, I will try and link down similar for you. So that I think will be useful. Those items will be useful as my outerwear. For shirts I've picked this time the, the striped red shirt. I could wear it layering over top of the t-shirts or just as the under item that then I put a jacket over the top of or a cardigan over the top of. Similarly a white shirt and this has appeared in many of the capsules until the weather gets too hot for this material and these long sleeves that it will carry on appearing because it's such a useful item. So a white shirt as well. I put down a short sleeve shirt in a stripe. This is a ivory and ivory and blue stripe short sleeve shirt. Then t-shirts. Yes, t-shirts are coming out. It's that time of year. T-shirts are coming out. Horizontal stripe t-shirt. Looks classic. Looks classy. Can make many of outfits with that. Navy t-shirt. So navy this time is my is, is going to be my uh, neutral. The navy t-shirt. I've also got a striped corally t-shirt. Coral and ivory t-shirt. Now this actually comes from Nordstrom. And I think the similar is still available, which I will link for you. So I've it last year and then I've got a light wash similar t-shirt it's the Caslon range at Nordstrom and um, similarly it's a, it's a light peachy colour perfect for the time of year. I've also picked a white t-shirt so my black t-shirts are gone they're not in appearing until the autumn I don't think I might change my mind but at the moment I don't think so so white t-shirt at this point in the video, I would like to thank Skillshare who are sponsoring a portion of the video. The reason I have decided to work with Skillshare is because I am so keen on women over 50 remaining relevant. And part of remaining relevant is actually pursuing our hobbies as we retire. It's maybe learning new things as well and just keeping up to date generally. One course I discovered is the Capsule Formula Wardrobe by Janae Jackson. And this course takes you deeper into understanding your style, how to evaluate what your style is, and work through various modules to actually hone your own wardrobe to one that suits your lifestyle and your taste and your colour palette. So I found that very interesting and goes into far more depth than you find elsewhere. Now maybe at this point in your life that you actually want to revisit old hobbies, maybe art, painting, sketching, gardening, indoor plants. There are so many modules and courses. It's ad-free, so you don't get the interruptions. You can actually relax and work through the modules of the courses. Thousands of courses being added each month, many added each week. First thousand people who use my code down below can have a one month free trial. Then we come on to blouses, and I, I tend to pick a couple of blouses or one blouse, depending on the size of the collection. Blouses that I could wear out with friends or seeing people or or you know doing something where you want to look a bit more attractive, vibrant, not in everyday clothes. So I have picked a t-shirt that's got ditzy little flowers on and ditzy little flowers are actually going to be the thing apparently this summer and spring but this is a short sleeved shirt so it's come out to play and it's going to go with a cardigan that I'm going to show you in a minute. I've also picked a navy short sleeved uh, blouse that I bought from Monsoon last year. Then on top of that, just in case we have a chilly day or chilly days, I and we are actually, um, the weather forecast is saying so, so I, I believe them, of course I believe the weather forecast. A striped gold jeweled Breton. Now this is not going to be so like Instagram worthy, it's not a posh outfit, but sometimes you just got to have things you can wear at home. 
So this is just for, this is for home and for going out, this collection of clothes. So just be practical. Um, pull out your old stuff that you're actually, you know, don't want to be seen necessarily at the pub in, but you answering the door, be fine. So this type of striped jewels shirt is thick and it's going to be practical. If you're enjoying this video, please do give me this. It is helping my channel. Thank you very much, ladies and gents. Cardigans are going to be handy. So I have chosen pink and a variety of other colours as well. Now I have got this cropped cardigan, but I've also got a long cardigan in pink. Both would be work with a collection of clothes I've pulled together so far. I'm also going to play with this beige one that I've had for years and years. I used to wear it to the office, so I thought actually I might as well see if I can actually wear it now. It's quite lightweight, it's a light knit. It might be a little bit dated looking at the back because it's got a sort of um, a seam across the back of it, but not really sure. So I will see how useful it is by, by pulling it out. If it's not, by the end of the month, if I've decided actually I don't like it, I don't want to wear it, I just put it in my pile of clothes that's going to be donated. Then I'm also going to similarly use, I've got this white duster that I used to wear in the office and it may well be an item that I can use at home. So I pulled this out to wear as well. It's quite a light knit again and could well be practical. So you may have some office clothes like this that you could pull out and wear. On top of that, I'm actually pulling out again my mustard cardigan that I absolutely adore. This was not in last month's collection of clothes, but I think it was in the previous month or twos. And I love the colour. I think now we're going to, in May, we may be more outside than inside, but it's going to be cooler in the evenings and so on. And so I really love, want to wear this cardigan in May. And I think it'll go beautifully with the ditzy blouse. That I mentioned earlier on. Then I've got the Air Force Blue cardigan that I bought from Marks and Spencer's last year and I've got a couple of jumpers. Oh I've got a white jumper and a pink jumper and another pink jumper but they're the right texture, right weight of material, right colour for me and will keep me warm if I'm doing something in an evening where it's chilly outside. And lastly I cannot resist putting back in in May this yellowish mustard jumper that I got from Jules and I'm doing this because so many of you said how much it suited me so I thought it's, good, it's the right colour, it's the right texture, it's the right weight for being outside in May in an evening. Let's use it especially as you guys like it on me and you've got to be right. Then we've got trousers, I'm going to use some navy chinos and some ivory jeans. Uh, I've got some navy joggers as well and some khaki. The khaki cargo pants are coming out because it's the right time of year. And hello khaki cargo pants, I've missed you. I've missed you since the autumn. I am really pleased to have you out again. And I'm putting in a pleated skirt because they're the thing again, but we're not wearing them with sweaters, we're wearing them with blouses or t-shirts. So pleated skirt, I may find some time to wear that as too. And Lastly, a dress. This is long sleeve floral dress. I had it in the last month and the month of fours and it's been useful. I have worn it a few times and I will continue to wear it. So I'm keeping this for May before we move into the sort of summer dresses as well. Now the idea is that you're going to go away and put your collection together and you're going to make up your outfits. Then halfway through the month, I'll show you what I've got so far. As I'm running out of ideas, I can pop up and say, here's what I've managed and there you go, go off and replicate. Right, off you go. Go and put your wardrobe for May together and I'll see you all in an outfit. 